Hi folks, it's Frank. I want to talk a little bit about the materials that I use. Okay, paper stone's very unique. It's very strong. Uh, it's an inch and a quarter inch thick. It's non-porous material. It's actually oven safe up to 350 degrees. Um, what else can I tell you? It's rated food safe by NF NFS, the uh, Food Safety Council. And uh, it's actually just an incredible product. I don't know if you can hear that or not. I'm sure you can. You probably backed up a little. But until you actually hold this in your hand, the density, it's, it's, hard, to, it's hard to fathom here. Um, and when it polishes up, it looks, you know, like, like this. Can you see that? Can you get that? Focus in on here. Can you see that okay? It's really just a beautiful shine. And the way that you get that beautiful shine is with this Osmo Top Oil. It's really good stuff, folks. This is all high quality, the best that I could buy. The steel threads I'm using are B7 thread. It's the strongest, most durable thread you can get. It's, 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 a cre it's, it's incredible. Anyway, I get excited. Please excuse me. Um, I also want to talk about this. This is where uh, the jack sits in the middle of this. And I just wanted to show you how that worked. And it, you know, how nice it is. It's a quarter inch thick. Um, I think people are concerned about the pressure and stuff on it. But this product at a quarter inch thick is, is strong. This is going to last a lifetime. Um, I really don't see any way this can be broken at all. Um, these are the screws that I make. I use the B7 steel. I take a one inch square of this and drill into it. I make one inch holes with a paddle so I can take these little washers and put them on there and screw them on there. And uh, you know if you ever have a problem with them you can just always run them through a nut and it'll straighten them out. But it's B7 steel so it's really really strong. I uh, also wanted to show you the stainless steel. It's, you know there's just nothing that's going to go wrong with this press. Um, I'm using all stainless steel on the nuts and the washers now. So if you have any questions Hopefully, maybe this answered some of them. There's always a link somewhere to get a hold of Paperstone or to find their product and see how incredible strong it is. Once again, this is Frank. I am the Juice Press Man. Thank you so much and have a great day.